Hello everyone, welcome to Afro News South Africa. If you are new to this channel, please kindly subscribe and share. Turn on the notification bell so that you would be notified each time we upload a new video. Thank you all for your support. Floyd Shivambu, one of the Economic Freedom Fighter member, earlier on warned South Africans concerning their take on the Russian vs. Ukraine war. He told South Africans that they should not deviate from supporting Russia or rather the British, Russia, India, China and South Africa BRICS group. He said that if South Africans attempt to separate themselves from the group, they will be set to face several threats from colonial and neo-colonial masters. Pertaining to a tweet being shared by the EFF party through their official Twitter handle, they reminded South Africans of Floyd Shivambu's word. On the tweet, it states, in case you miss it, Floyd Shivambu warns that South Africa must never distance itself from BRICS. This was shared by Floyd Shivambu to South Africans through an audio message. He also added that all countries under the BRICS group are aimed at promoting infrastructural and economic development and not colonialism. He also said that with the BRICS, South Africa trade has gotten attraction from over millions of people around the globe. In line with the vaccine, he said that the BRICS has made assurance to help South Africans out on vaccination. Numerous people are still confused about the link South Africa has with BRICS. Okay now, South Africa joined the BRICS to emerge its economy in December 2010. This was made in line with the country's foreign policy to strengthen South Africa relations. South Africa remains committed to the consolidation of the African agenda and will use its BRICS membership to increase strategic cooperation among emerging market economies of the South supporting this agenda. South Africa is dedicated to African unity and integration within the framework of the Constitutive Act of the African Union AU. This includes the strengthening of continental institutions which are critical in responding to the challenges of poverty, underdevelopment, peace, security and stability on the continent. South Africa, in line with showing off some concern about BRICS, also hosted the Fit BRICS Summit from 26 to 27 March 2013 at the Dubai International Convention Center, ICC. This completed the first cycle of BRICS Summit. So this should be enough to those who didn't know about BRICS. Floyd Shivambu has now warned South Africans to continue supporting the BRICS unless her initial aim of joining will be eliminated. What can you say about this? Thanks very much for watching.